fuck's going on over here? Oh, oh, I broke my fucking chair! Check my balls with Chuck E. Cheese's fuck my ass. Alright guys, welcome back! Welcome back to another fucking video. Uh, what's my hat looking like? I don't like that, fuck that. I would not wear a hat. Usually I don't wear hats, but since my hair is fucking disgusting and gross, and if I pull it back, it looks like I'm losing hair, uh, like I'm a fucking cancer patient at St. Jude's Research Hospital. So here's what I'm gonna fucking do. I'm gonna wear a hat. I'm gonna wear a hat. I'm Santa Claus. You know why? Because it's fucking Christmas almost. It's time to get in that fucking holly jolly ch sheer spirit. Uh, don't do what I did last video, acting like a fucking depressed ass motherfucker. Today, we're gonna be Santa motherfuckers, alright? It's hot as fuck in my room. My nards are sweating, if that's a word. Uh, my room is a fucking disaster, as you can see. Uh, my bed, I tried to jump on my bed and jump into my chair, and I broke it, and then I broke it again coming into my chair. I'm a fucking fat tub of lard. Uh, Santa should not bring me anything. Um, and who knows, maybe when I put out the fucking cookies and milk, I will fucking eat that shit. I will gobble up those delicious, delectable double chocolate chip cookies and drink down that milk to satisfy and just run down with the chocolate like I'm drinking a mouthful of cum or some shit. I don't know. Anyway, let's get into this shit. Today, uh, well, after Christmas we got New Year's Eve and then we have a new year. Um, and this year went by really quick, but the reason why was because this year was probably the shittiest year that we've ever had to face in the history of our lives. Uh, unless you're around for the Great Depression and shit like that. In which case, why are you watching a fucking 20-year-old on YouTube do shit like this? I don't know what you're doing. Go fuck yourself. Um, so today, what we're going to be doing is doing a tier list of tragic events that happened this year. Um, F is the least amount of tragedy so if it's like not that tragic it'll go in f but if s s is the most tragic shit that's happened this year a lot of shit expect a lot of shit in s and then it just ranges in between with a b c d e um let's, let's get into it let's let's just do it so first off what are we starting off with here we have um what the fuck is this nick i don't know he designed this shit what the fuck is this it's like Looks like, uh, looks like what I found in the toilet after my dad got out this morning or some shit like that. I don't know. Yes, I know this is coronavirus. So coronavirus has killed a lot of people, but you know what kills a lot more people? Forklift accidents. Uh, it's a, it's a true fact. Go look it up. Go fuck yourself if you don't believe me. Um, coronavirus? Well, let's, let's talk about coronavirus. Um, it's pretty dangerous. I mean, a lot of people don't even think this exists. That's how dangerous it is. It's able to fuck with your mind because people are like, oh, it doesn't exist. Ah. So, I think it's killed a lot of people. I want to say, like, murderers kill more people every year, though. Like, I think there's more murders than there are COVID deaths, right? Right? Like, I'm not going to look up the statistic. You guys can look that shit up. I'm just going off what I know because I'm really knowledgeable and I don't need to look at fucking Google. Google looks at me. Google says Adam's got all the fucking answers, so fuck Google, fuck, um, yeah, this is going to be, coronavirus doesn't kill that many people, honestly, I mean, it doesn't kill that many people, um, fuck you if you disagree, next up, we got murder hornets, murder hornets, you can remember this, this fucking shit, everyone was like, oh god, shit, shit, I forgot where these come from, I almost said China, did these come from China, oh my god, China, we got the murder hornets, oh no, uh, the murder hornets coming to America, they're gonna kill us all! But they didn't do anything. They didn't fucking do anything. You know what they did? They came and they bounced. They went boing and then bounced back to wherever the fuck they came from. Um, no one died. No one got stung. Everyone was fine, except the only person that got stabbed or stung was that one mother, stupid motherfucker that does it for views on YouTube. I'm gonna sting myself. Fucking sting myself for views. Ah! Honestly, this is, this is like, not that tragic. It's going in F. It didn't do shit. You fuck. Alright, World War Three. Uh, you guys can't see that. Let me color it up for you. There we go. World War Three. This shit was scary, right? 
at the beginning of January, we were all threatened with World War III. Was I going to have to go into the draft? Was I going to have to go fight? No, we didn't have to because it never fucking happened. This is going in F as well. Now we got Australia on fire. Um... I don't know, man. Australia is, is tragic, right? I was trying to look for tragic events, and then this shit came up, and I was like, oh, wow. And it was funny, because a lot of people were like, what about California? California was also on fire. Oh, fuck California. Fuck California. If you're Californian, I'm sorry. I don't mean to offend you. But, um, yeah. Um, California is... California's always on fire, okay? Australia's not on fire. Think about all the koala bears. Oh, God. Oh, well, the koala bears are already fucking extinct anyway, aren't they? Well, fuck that. This is pretty tragic, uh, but it's not that tragic. Again, I think more people die in, like, murders every year, so honestly, fuck Australia. All right, but then we had, like, a lot of shit happen this year with deaths and shit. Um, we had a lot of celebrities die. Um, so this is Josh Peck. Um, with his gigantic ass schmeat. You guys see that right there? Right here. Um, look at that schmeat. Do we zoom in? Alright, thank you. Uh, and we have a lot, we had a lot of celebrities die. And not just celebrities, we had a lot of people die. You know, it all sucked. But, again, I think more people die from murder, you know? I just, I just don't find this very, I mean, who fucking died? Who died this year that anyone gives a shit about? Like, Alex Trebek? Who the fuck is Alex Trebek? Who watches... What's that one show? Monopoly? Who watches that fucking shit? No, I don't watch that shit. I don't care about Alex Trebek. And, and... Uh, Sean Connery? I don't fucking care about... Um, what is that? Mission Impossible or whatever the fuck it's called. Fuck that shit. I don't know what that is. Um, next up we got George Floyd. Uh, this was pretty bad. Um, I'm not a political person. But honestly, I think more people die in murders, but I can't really use that here because he, he was murdered. Um, I'm going to put in an F, though, for Floyd. He got Floyded. Ha! <laughs> Floyded like Floyd dead. Floyd is dead. Fentanyl. F. <laughs> I'm actually going to put this in, like, B. This was pretty shit. This is pretty fucking tragic. This was bad. This was really bad. Next up, we have Baby Yoda. Now, you may be like, what? why is Baby Yoda out here? Look at Baby Yoda, he's so fucking cute. Look at his little fucking ears and his little fucking eyes. People are falling in love with this, <laughs> this little shit because, I don't know, I guess they just fall in love with Gizmo fucking on acid or some shit. Gizmo injecting black tar heroin into his lung, into his veins and lung. Uh, I don't know. I don't fuck with this thing. This this kid is shit. This kid is why? Why would you why why would you care about a fucking baby Gizmo? Does anyone even watch Star Trek anymore? Like honestly, what the fuck? This was really tragic that this happened. This exists. It's really tragic. Jenna Marbles. Uh my girlfriend introduced me to Jenna Marbles and I mean I knew about her existence, but I never really watched her stuff until my girlfriend and I started watching together and uh it's pretty tragic uh all because a bunch of bitches don't know what the fuck they're talking about and you know bitches ain't shit so this is pretty tragic i'll put this in a uh and then why was there an, uh, what oh yeah oh yeah aliens exist guys aliens fucking exist you ever seen that shit you saw the, the fucking ufos and then it was just what um but honestly, the aliens haven't done shit, really. I don't know if there's a galactic federation or whatever Trump is saying there is, but, you know, they, ha they haven't really done anything, have they? I mean, it's not like they're like, yo, what's up, man? What's up, man? What's up, dude? So I'm going to put them in D. They really didn't do anything. I think it's cool they exist, I guess. But, like, I don't know. I don't really care about that shit. All right, so now we have a baby. You're probably like, why is there a baby here? Um... Adam, do you really hate babies? Do you, do you think it's a bad thing that babies are born every year? Well, yeah. I mean, who doesn't hate babies? I fucking hate babies. <laughs> nah, the real reason the baby's on here is because of all those crybaby bitches that won't shut the fuck up 
about Cyberpunk being a shit game because of all the glitches. Because it's honestly your fault that this game is shitty, and it's out already, and it's buggy, and everything. It's your fucking fault. If you're complaining about it, it's your fault. Because you were the same bitches, the same motherfuckers, that demanded that they release it, and then every time I got pushed back, I'll go... <laughs> And then they were like, fuck it, we're going to push it back, all right? We'll push it back. And then they pushed it back, and you guys were like, Aah! and then they fucking released it, and you were like, Aah! so that was pretty shitty, guys. Uh, big bra moment, epic cringe right there. So that was pretty, I'm going to put that in A. You want an A. All right, we have two more. So bear with me here. We have GTA 5. The biggest shit that happened this year, the worst possible thing that happened this year, was the fact that Grand Theft Auto 5 is being re-released on PS5. Rockstar had an opportunity to release Bully 2. Uh, Run to Nightmare 2. Uh, GTA 6. But they didn't. You know what they did? They said, we'll, we'll release GTA 5 again. And they did. So that's going in S. That was really fucking sad. I cry every time. Every time. And then the last one on the list is the movie theaters closing. Honestly, I'm a movie theater person, and I don't really give a shit about this. F tier. F tier. Alright guys, there's your 2020 uh, tier list video. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Uh, it helps out a lot. All right, guys, that's going to do this do it for this video, uh, this episode of Tier Listing uh, 2020 Events. Now, I would like to say, if you guys did not see your favorite event, if you guys were just like, oh my god, where's my favorite tragic event? I, I can't believe it didn't make the list because you guys are a fucking bunch of sickos that like actually having tragic events happen, uh, and it didn't make you the list, I apologize. But do I really? No, I don't really, because these are the most tragic events. You could put anything up there. Um, the only thing that maybe would surpass it is the amount of murders we have in this country.